What it do, Flight Crew? FTC. Flight Team, stand up! FTC, the strongest, is finally August. We got the man Dor Martin with some fresh heat. A lot of you guys was asking me I should react to something that comes out the same day. We don't supply the FTC brothers and sisters. We got employee fired for giving free food. What happens next is shocking. Now, these are always very, very edgy, man, and this never disappoints once again, bro. A lot of people can relate to it, should be relating to it, not necessarily the fire part or just, you know, but just in general, just if you raise your hand if you work fast food before me, two of them. You know what I'm saying? Before we pursue to be a substitute teacher. All right. See what happens. All right. Check it out. And that'll be 250. I thought I had more. <clears throat> Let me check. Okay. I only have dollar fifty. I'm so sorry. Wait. Don't worry about it. Okay? Ah, no, bro. Oh. Fuck. That's where I feel like this is going to lead him to doing something like going down a bad wrong. Bro, there's a way you can just give it, just give the food. You don't got to, don't ever take nothing from the tip jar, bro. Don't ever do that, bro. You know what I'm saying? Now, I've looked out for hella people, especially, you know what I'm saying, when I was working fast food, bro. You know what I'm saying? Especially the ones that complain, you know. That's that's the key thing that, like, I just don't understand, like, people that be working, you know what I'm saying? They're like, don't argue with the customer. They're there for the food, you know what I'm saying? They want to argue. They're just school threats, bro. Like, I'll give you whatever you want, bro. Just don't complain. Don't bitch at me. Don't cuss me out because we're going to have some issues. You know what I'm saying? I was always a favorite every single time. Like every every like a lot of the people's there. Like uh like 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 regular customers that are coming shit or whatever. Because man, it's the character. Bro, he had a good way of going, but he just went about it the wrong way, bro. Don't take from the tip jar. Moral of the thing, because it's like you're stealing from charity, so that's like a double bad thing. Like Really? And then it's just like on the top of that Thank whatever so the business good. is doing. Do ah, I'm just helping this man. Yeah, give me that. Damn, Damn that's the boss. Selling food, not giving it away. Now you can come back when you have the exact 250. But sir, I'm trying to feed my son. Please, he hasn't eaten in days. Yeah, right. He probably don't even have a son. But you know what? Get out of here. Get out of here before I call the police. Now, yeah, he's acting like an asshole and shit. But in a way, he does. In a way, he's still wrong. Don't get it fucked up, but. He does have a point in a way. There'll be some homeless people because I've dealt with that before. Like, that'll literally lie on anything and get whatever. But, still, it's just a damn hot dog, bro. It's just food. Just give it to him, bro. He's probably really hungry. He probably has a hungry kid. You know what I'm saying? It's not that serious, bro. You know what I'm saying? But you know what? Get out of here. Get out of here. The before I call hell? the police. I was just in my tip money. Let me ask you something. Oh, that was his tip money. Okay, so now that changes the whole ball game. He was he's not even in the wrong. Why is this dude so mad? I thought see I see places sometimes be having like tip jars and that's for the whole business. That's where you get in trouble because you can't that's like taking it from the charity or whatever. I thought that was what they was doing. That's his tips. He gets paid off the tips and you know what I'm saying? But bro. Hot dog stand? Yeah, that man is just overreacting for sure, no, bro. It's, it's not mine. that serious. And it costs a lot of money to open up one of these. And I don't need homeless people lined up begging for free handouts because Sammy the Sumerian works here. Who did you just call him? Bro, we're gonna have to fight. You call talk to me like that, bro. Look at you throwing all that food out that you could have gave away for free, bro. Goofy. Call me back when I take out the trash. Take this with you. What a this is so much food, food bro. What do you want? And that is a thing. That is a look right here. This is the last time I paused the video, by the way. This is the bro. This is the exact reason I was all I'm all for like giving, like not being so like like stingy with giving free food bro this is exactly what they do in every fast food restaurant bro i used to work the steak and shake work the chick-fil-a bro steak and shake bro that at least throwing away 25 plus burgers pounds of fries nuggets tenders bro uh shakes nobody's gonna drink a shake obviously if they hungry like that like all the time because of wrong orders um the wrong thing cooked things like that same thing with chick-fil-a bro i see motherfucking 
300 piece nugget, bro, down the trash can, Chick fil A sandwiches, cookies, bro, uh, fruit, you know, cups, salads, bro, that they could have gave for free, bro. Like, this is so, much, so food. much food, bro. What do you want me to do, man? Business has been slow and we can't sell day old hot dogs. You could have gave one, not the day old one, but. These to some homeless people. You know, you're not too bright, are you, kid? You know, if people found out that we are giving away old food, they're not going to buy any of our new food. All right, so he stop asking point. dumb right. questions and throw it away. But, bro, you're not going to talk to him like that, bro. Like, what's good with you? Humble yourself, bro. You're working at a yes, hot dog me, place sir. at the end of the Would day, you bro. Please help me you don't please talk to nobody like you're better than nobody please. else. We haven't eaten anything yet. Please help us out. I'm so sorry. I don't have anything on me. Dad. I'm so hungry. Damn. Don't worry, baby. We'll eat soon. I promise. Hey. No, bro, don't offer him. No, bro, yourself. please don't offer him that. And you can take one for yourself too, okay? My goodness. God bless you. you now don't give him the one in the trash, you. man. Look, Mom, that guy from David Socks is giving them some food. I like them dude in the uh, yellow shirt, bro. He has good intentions. Would you like a hot People dog like food? that go far in life. Yes. But you can't be too caring because love gets you killed or in trouble, bro. Remember that. What are you doing? Too much of I it. I told you to throw those things away. This dude is so stingy, bro. I'm sorry. I just felt bad. These aren't your hot dogs. These are mine, and I get to decide what I want to do with them. First of all, that's pause. Like, what did you just say? You're throwing them out. There are hungry kids around the world that are less fortunate, and you're throwing them out. You're not doing anything with the hot dogs, bro. I know, but look. Gosh, man. Does it make you feel good? Knowing that you fed some hungry people instead of just throwing them away. No. That's good for them. What does it do for me? Well, I've always believed that the good you put out into the world always finds a way of getting back to you. You see, when I was a kid, my mom and I were homeless. We were so poor that a lot of days we didn't even have any food to eat. But whenever things would get really bad, we knew we could always count on a kind restaurant owner to help us. He always Real gave us one right food there. whenever we were really hungry. And that man right there, he's probably owning like five different companies, uh, ten and billion dollars, bro. Kind man helped so many people. Like that's the thing that people what don't understand. Like this, and... this man right here, like th that acts like this. Like, bro, do you really think God is gonna bless somebody that acts the way they do in a hot dog stand? You think he's not sitting down looking down at you? Like this is the thing that people don't understand. Everything you do, bro. It's going to have a reaction, it's going to have karma, it's going to have something looking at you whether somebody's in the room or not. Re, uh, like, rewind that and listen to it twice. Don't let it go over your head. All right, bro. People like this dude right here in the blue shirt, like, literally are, are swimming in money, bro. Because Customers they bless others and they are money. unproblematic, bro. And they never let anything, the numbers get too above the their head, bro. Came back to him. It's not that damn hard, but apparently so to other people it is. It's always good to be kind to people. Just trust me. Trust you? You can't even follow simple instructions. How can I possibly trust you? Look, sir, I... Do you own this hot dog stand, Sammy? No. But you know what? It is a dream of mine to one day have my own hot dog stand so that I can feed other people. Well, Please don't act like him, How bro. are you magically going to make that happen? It costs 25 grand to even start one. How are you going to put enough money together when you love to give everything wait, away? Wait, wait. How much is it to start and open up a restaurant? 25 racks? 2022 Flight Reacts restaurant and dispensary coming, bro. I don't know how much dispensary be like. But that's actually a goal of mine. Dispensary and a restaurant opening up in 2022, bro. Free. You're right. I'm sorry. Sorry's not gonna cut it. Now you can come in tomorrow and you can pick up your last check. Because you are fired. What the fuck? You don't understand. I need this. How am I supposed to pay my bills? Maybe you'll think twice about disobeying your boss. And don't think that I'm not going to deduct those hot dogs from your pay. Nah, bro. <laughs> he said deduct hot dogs from... Bro, we don't have... Bro, right then and there, bro. Throw it away. We don't have to... Bro, you don't have to shoot me one, bro. Then you can officially fire me, bro. What a selfish fucking dude, David, bro. you are David, as in David's dogs, correct? Yes, I am. And this is my company. Hey, here you go, bud. Thanks. Let me get you some change. Keep the change. The work you're doing is really incredible. Well, thank you, man. I appreciate that. 
So was it your idea to use leftover hot dogs to feed the homeless? I... Ooh. I just got news that a GoFundMe has been set up and a lot of money has already been donated. A lot of money? Yes. So this was all your idea then? Yes. Of course, it, this was all my idea. I mean, I really enjoy helping people. You see, it's... No! That's the homeless dad and son from the video! How did it feel having David help you and your son? He didn't help him. David? He didn't help me. Thank you. He yelled at me. Thank you. What are you talking about? Talk your about? shit. Didn't this man feed you? Are you kidding me? He fired his employee for feeding us. Yeah. Is that true? Uh, hey, Sammy. Sammy boy. Nah, bro. Nah, bro. Get off him. Get off him. Get off of him with that He's fake love, bro. Get off of him. He's the one who really helped us. He's bro, this him. I'm scared of people like this so much, bro. Because it's so sad there's actually people like this. Like, he literally is so... He's a literal de delusional, like, demon, bro. Like, you literally just talk to this man like he was the biggest, like, piece of, like dookie in the world bro like the other day like 24 hours ago but when an opportunity calls bro like bro you're acting better than like <laughs> you bro you're acting better than will smith right now like what the fuck like i'm scared of people like this bro it really helped us what is going on well someone uploaded a video of always you watch our circle bro homeless, and it's already gotten over three million views People absolutely love the work you and your company are doing. But I don't have a company anymore. I got fired yesterday. What? Exposed. You fired him? Why would you do that? It was a joke. No, oh, it's not April rascal. Fool's baby. Don't get my sense of humor. Get your ass on. Yesterday you were yelling at me because I was giving away free hot dogs instead of throwing them into the trash. And then you fired me. Talk your shit. Oh, I am so not supporting you. Hey, my man's open up, open up that uh that your own restaurant, bro. You're just gonna leave like that? Well, that was interesting. This is Caitlin Keurig signing off. Cut. That was crazy. <laughs> Seriously. They got a viral uh, video, huh? Good luck. Take care. Karma. Hey, mom, there he is. It's you. Do I know you? My son's bro, come on, that's that not how you do that, bro. You. Don't say that. All those people <laughs> yeah, what you did was awesome. Thank you. <laughs> I really appreciate it. Still didn't stop me from getting fired, though. You got fired? No. That's not fair. I'm so sorry. What are you going to do now? I don't know. I do want to get my own hot dog stand, but just I don't have enough money. I'll figure it out. See you later. Wait, wait, uh, what about the GoFundMe, Marcus? Oh yeah, hold on. You have thirty thousand dollars. <laughs> thirty like okay. curry! All the world saw what you did. And they've been donating money to you. Open up that hot dog stand. Wait, are you serious? Bro, it's really twenty-five yeah, racks to open up a hot dog stand? Well, to be exact. Thirty thousand and two hundred and twenty dollars. I can't believe it. You, you don't understand how much this is going to change my life. Thank you both. This is crazy, man. So inspirational, bro. So, you got your job back, huh? Actually, nah, you bought your own. I bought the hot dog stand. Yeah! It's now Sammy Sausages. Alrighty. Wow. I love but it. Congrats, man. Two dollars. Nah, don't take it, bro. This time, I hope you don't. <laughs> Here, just... Keep it. Lifetime supply free. The house, okay? Yeah. Here's one for you too. You have a real Can I have one? Board. Thank you. Hey, what do you say? Thank you. <laughs> of course. <laughs> well, if this story teaches us anything, it's the good you put out into the world always has a way of coming back to you. It's facts. And cut. Okay, what should we do for lunch? Sammy. How about a hot dog? <laughs> we 
Hey man, this is your man. Come on over there, Razz. Razz, man, a little for me, man.